The Ag Minute is brought to you by your Louisiana propane dealers, fuel for our future, and by Progressive Tractor and Implement Company, your Case IH dealer, serving Louisiana and Southeast Arkansas. Well, I guess all those Chick-fil-A cow commercials have paid off for the poultry industry. Americans are eating more chicken than ever before. According to the U.S. Department of Agriculture, on average, each American consumes about 84 pounds of chicken each year. But do you ever stop to think about what it takes to get that chicken breast to your plate? Well, you're in luck. I've got the answer in this week's Ag Minute. How much corn would a chicken farmer grow if a chicken farmer could grow corn? The answer, a lot. Chicken is big business in Louisiana, and to feed that business, you need a whole lot of corn. It is essential to the poultry industry. Like I said, that's our primary feed ingredient, primary feedstuffs for poultry diets. The poultry industry uses all the corn it can find. LSU Ag Center poultry science professor Dr. Teresa Laverne says the Louisiana broiler industry alone consumes more than 27 million bushels of corn each year. Each chicken, each of those 214 million head here in Louisiana are going to eat at least seven pounds of corn in their lifetime. So if we take that seven pounds of corn and multiply it by our 214 million head of chickens, We've got a lot of corn we've used in our poultry industry. She says it's important for grain and livestock farmers to remember that their businesses go hand in hand. Some farmers may think I'm a grain producer and that's a poultry producer or another livestock producer. What do we have in common? But they actually are dependent on each other. First, the poultry industry has to have feed, especially corn, so that grain producer has to produce it. On the other side, that grain producer needs a market for what they produce if they want to keep producing their crops. So going, you know, they, they kind of go hand in hand, the livestock poultry production, production as well as the grain production. They each need each other to both be productive and to uh, be efficient as well. In the last decade, fast food companies have been putting more chicken on their menus, and restaurants saw a 12% jump in menu items, including chicken, from 2009 to 2012. McDonald's is the second largest purchaser of chicken in the country. Well, now it's time for Twilight Trivia. Last week I asked you, what is the term for an immature cotton flower bud? And the correct answer is a square. This week our question is, which part of a rooster will help him gain the attention of a hen? Is it A, a beak, B, feathers, or C, his waddle? To enter this week's Twilight Trivia Contest, simply log on to your Facebook or Twitter account and post the answer with the hashtag Twilight Trivia. Or you can always submit your answer on our website at twilighttv.org.